Welcome back. Today in our Make Believe Kitchen is on the border, helping us celebrate National Fajita Day. And Aaron, let's just start right now. On the Border created National Fajita Day, yes. didn't you? Yes, National Fajita Day is for us because we invented a sizzling fajita. That, well, that belongs to us <laughs> back in 2016. Wow, this is so awesome. And I'm going to use those words throughout the morning time with this because we're looking at some awesome food. Yes. Uh, and we're also looking at some awesome fun. We're going to be making some uh, great dishes of yours. Um, first, let's start with what these dishes are up here, the fajita dishes. Yes, this fajita dish right here is our Monterey Ranch Chicken Fajita. So it has our, it's a mesquite grilled chicken with ranch dressing, crumbled bacon, and Monterey Jack cheese on Top. Oh my goodness. Yes. All right. And then over here. And then we have our sizzling fajita, uh, steak fajita. So, oh my goodness. Oh, what is a fajita? It's, it's just uh, meat cut up. Sizzling. Sizzling, yeah. Nice That's... and sizzling and hot sizzling. I like it. And, and these are edible, right? Absolutely. So, I, okay, hold on. Let me just. I didn't Go know they were that. edible. Just a moment. <laughs> sorry. Can I, may I? Just to make sure. After you. All right, what I'll do is this I'll let you get going to make in the dish. Okay. And I'll taste this. Well, what okay. we're going to do, we're going to make the marinade that we use every day in the restaurant. Okay. So what that consists of is going to be a three quarters cup of pineapple juice. Okay. You can keep going. I'm listening. <clears throat> and three quarters cup of water. Okay. We also have a three quarter cup of soy sauce. Okay. And you definitely want to get this going and you can make this in advance if you need to. <clears throat> the best part about it too is that you can also, uh, you, you are going to need to marinate that for three and a half hours. Three and a half yeah, hours? Yeah, because it breaks, it breaks up that meat so it makes it more tender, more juicy and everything. So. But if I just come to on the border, it's already done for oh, me, right? Oh yeah, so it's done for you. <laughs> but if you want to do this at home, you are more than welcome <laughs> to. So once that's done, everything is all ready to go and then you have your finished product and you would just go ahead and put that right on the grill, mesquite grill, and you're good to go. That's it? Yeah. That's really it's very, good. very simple. So and is, do you use different meats and stuff, or do you can use any kind, or what? Uh, more simply a steak, because that's what's going to break it up. Break it up more? Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, okay, and then what's the dish right next to you? And right here we have, this is what comes with the fajitas. It's our uh, black beans, cilantro, lime, rice, and this is all your fixings for your fajita. You can put some uh, fresh made guacamole that we make in store, and then we also top it off with our fresh made queso, salsa, and chips. Oh, my God. And these are fresh chips? Are these real chips? Yep, absolutely. Can I test one? Go for it. i got to taste some <laughs> right. just to make sure. Please. Oh yeah, those are those are real chips. All right, oh, yes. that's good. <laughs> I like those. All right, and you said this is a steak one, right? Yes. Uh -huh. All right, let me just test that one. <clears throat> so let me just see. I gotta make sure. Oh, Aaron. Perfect. Aaron. Mm -hmm. Aaron. Yes. Aaron. <laughs> yes. Oh, oh. And there's plenty. There's there, plenty I, know, I like that. Okay, margaritas. Yes. So we What's actually in the bag. <laughs> uh, right here, these are our margaritas that you can take home. So those are good for you to take home and have a fiesta at home. There. And right now we have our a watermelon margaritas, so you can pair that with any fajita. Only five dollars right now. That's it, five dollars. Five dollars. Yes. So and you can take that home with you. Yes, and the good thing about our watermelon margarita is that we make that puree fresh in house also. Do you? So we're a scratch kitchen, so we make a lot of our fresh stuff fresh. I like, it. and you have different locations. How many yes. different locations do we you have? We have three right? locations in the Phoenix area. So we have our Albuquerque location, Superstition Springs, and Peoria. I like that. Is that a real margarita? Yep. Can I? I'm, well, let me there make you sure. Go. <laughs> I gotta make sure. You know, uh, it is. Is it Friday yet? It's Friday every day. It's a Friday every day. <laughs> so let me just make sure. Oh, yeah. 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 All right. So how can people celebrate National Fajita Day with you? Go ahead and come down to any one of our three locations. And we're open from 11 a.m. until 11, uh, 11 p.m. I like that. And, and again, um, I, I literally, I, I'm sorry, just one more time just to make sure. Help yourself. And I got to. Oh, Aaron. Oh, yeah. Oh, Aaron's my new friend. <laughs> there you Forget go. that other Aaron. <laughs> so, yeah, so we're going to be celebrating that today. So come in and see us. We actually have happy hour going from 3 to 6 today. Ooh, yeah? Yeah, so we have our new bar bites that start at $5. And they're all $5, so it's a good thing. And our margaritas, $5, too. I like that. So everything's $5. Oh, yeah. So five, I can't like go this, wrong. And just sell it for you today. It's for us, and it's for everybody. There you go. All right, if they want to order online, what's the website? Uh, www.ontheborder.com. I like it. Can I just test this one? Yes, oh, Aaron, you I can. Sure. To you. And then to make everybody feel safe, too, we do actually do our social distancing dine-in, too. Yeah. We also have also, uh, curbside and also delivery through our third-party site.